I've actually talked to people before about a metaphor of trying to describe the program. There are so many that are offered to CEOs and managing directors around the globe. And to try to describe why I choose this one, I'm an oarsman. And it's the difference of when you're in a single skull and you're out there rowing and you're responsible for monitoring the wind and the waves and the navigation and your competition. Every piece of your journey in that shell is on your shoulders. And that is very much what it's like to be a CEO. The difference is when I come here, I feel as though I've put my single skull away and I've moved into the eight. I now have a coxswain who's helping with the navigation and the strategy, and we're all pulling in the same direction. All of us become one, and we're going towards the same goal. I run an automotive business, which is a family business, which has been set up in 1960. And I took over the business in 2005, when my father passed away at the age of 18. From a financial point of view, it has helped me to look at the balance sheet and the accounting side of the business. We have had very, very different lecturers from different perspectives, such as pricing, HR, and that has helped me look look at progressive ways of how we can develop the business going forward. Recently we've done two acquisitions and uh, I had no experience of that and all I have learned was at LBS. One of the take-home values that uh, has impacted my business directly is transitioning from a, a family-owned business into a corporation and one of the challenges that we had was making that transition as we grew. I had to worry about how to grow the company, but on top of that, how to be a father, how to be a spouse, how to look after my health. And what I found here at the LBS program with fellow YPRs is an environment where I could learn from people from all over the world. I can enjoy the type of intimacy that only comes in a forum setting, but do it with people that have the exact same interests that I have in business, the same challenges that I'm having in growth entrepreneurial businesses, and also the same passion for balancing that with many other aspects of their life. One of the classes that we have here on financing your business with your customers' cash has opened my eyes to how to finance a startup business without having to seek outside capital. This had a big impact on me when looking at my sharing economy and what kind of good can be done also through physical products and connecting them with specific causes in the world. That I implemented that in my business, I started a new brand, and it is a customer-funded business model. And you apply it right then, right there, before you ever leave London, to your own business. And so we have a kind of a shared vision and a shared goal. The, the time that we have together matters, and that we're gonna make the most of it that we can, so that when we leave here, we're ready to kind of take what we learn and apply it directly to make the biggest impact that we can for our families, for our businesses, uh, and for our community. YPO itself is a special club. The faculty and world-class speakers challenge people to have great practical take-home. I actually went back to the business and we actually put everyone in the business through a strengths finder exercise and just talked about where they were strong. That has allowed me to tap into YPO shared experience and really help drive the business without thinking I've just got to work harder and harder. Here you're in what I think is the capital of the world. This is a true melting pot but also you leave and you build contacts so if I ever needed anything in the Middle East I've got a ton of people that I've shared the forum experience with year after year. Our own programs, our own needs evolve and what we learn on the program evolves. The ingredients change each time. Every year since that first year in 2003, there's been another case or another lecture that's added to a broader mosaic of what it really means to be entrepreneurial and what it really means to embrace organizational change. Pairing with evidence-based academics who are looking at the processes around our real-world challenges that we as leaders have to deal with, that accelerated my personal learning. When I know the dates of the following year, that's the first thing that goes in my calendar. Getting a global perspective from all the continents of the world. This course, it's like family. The people and connections and the lifelong friendships you form here. They have really changed my life. Now I have my teammates with me and we're going towards the same goal. It's something you can't get anywhere else.